fallacy of composition and division. What's a fallacy? A fallacy is an error in reasoning. If you commit a fallacy, it doesn't mean you said anything wrong. It means you came up with the answer the wrong way. The answer could be right, you just came up with it wrong. For example, you could use stereotypes or racism. You could say, well, this guy committed the crime because he's black. It's an error in reasoning that you came up with that. It's a fallacy, it's an error in reasoning. He may have committed the crime, or he may not. But the reasoning to come up with it was an error. You see how that works? So the fallacy of composition, the fallacy of division, these are two types. There's dozens and dozens and dozens of fallacies. I just want to introduce two of them to you right now. The fallacy of composition is when you go from a, a, an individual or specific thing to a group. Division is when you take a group of things and you go to the individual. So if you take a specific claim about an individual and you assume that that claim also applies to the group that the individual is a part of. John is Asian. John is short. Therefore, all Asians must be short. <clears throat> Pete is white. Pete drives a BMW. All white people must drive BMWs. It could work the other way around. Statistically, more Hispanics are in prison than whites. Therefore, Jose's Hispanic. He's probably in prison. Is a lot of time used as stereotype, stereotypical things one way or the other. See how it could be applied either way. It doesn't have to be the, that, though. It could be totally outside of that. You could say something like, this spark plug is a very expensive spark plug, and it's placed in this Mazda. Therefore, the Mazda must be an expensive car. You could say, this BMW is very expensive. Therefore, the spark plugs must be expensive. You see how it doesn't have to? It could be something stupid and just totally generic. You could say that a brick is heavy. Therefore, all the particles that make up the brick must also be heavy. LeBron James is the best player, therefore the Lakers must be the best team. It can work in a million different ways, but that's generally how it works. You take the characteristics or traits of an individual, apply it to the group, and you have a composition, fallacy of composition. You take the division fallacies, you take the, comp the characteristics or traits of a group of things or group of individuals, and you apply it to the individual within it.